hello students welcome back to our channel kcyc in this video we will continue with your algebra quadratic equation ka exercise number 2.4 so let's do with the exercise 2.4 okay today we will be doing with your exercise aaj ye karenge that is exercise 2.4 what do you got in exercise 2.4 your standard form of a quadratic equation is ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 to a hai this is your b this is your c now what do we get over here that is what is y formula the so standard formula this is the value of a this is the value of b this is the value of c so 2.4 mein you got a formula so what is the formula that is x is equal to minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac upon 2a sab kuch hai na aapka ye b square minus 4ac pe depend hai so you have three cases for this that is b square minus 4ac can be equal to 0 you get over here b square minus 4ac will be less than 0 or you can have this is b square minus 4ac is greater than 0 these are your discriminants kya hote isko discriminants agar b square minus 4ac is equal to 0 then the roots roots bolega to your answers your roots are you can say this is equal या रूट्स आर इक्वल मतलब सिर्फ आपको एक ही आंसर आएगा कि b स्क्वायर माइनस 4ac इज लेस देन 0 देन यू कैन से ओवर द रूट्स आर यू कैन से ओवर या नॉट रियल नॉट रियल भी होगा तो बेसिकली व्हेनेवर यू गेट नेगेटिव b स्क्वायर माइनस 4ac अगर नेगेटिव आ गया तो ये सम को छोड़ देने का यू डू नॉट हैव टू डू दिस सम दिस शो यू विद द एग्जांपल्स इफ b स्क्वायर माइनस 4ac इज ग्रेटर देन 0 देन यू शुड से the roots are that is real and unequal so you have to understand this three things very nicely if b square minus 4 is equal to 0 less than 0 and this is greater than 0 if we see with the exercise first uh, 2.4 ka first example it's very easy i do as it's very easy you got an equation of this type that is x square minus 7x Plus five is equal to zero. You have to just tell it in the form of what are a, what is b, and what is c. So you can see where this is of the form that is a x square plus b x plus c is equal to zero. Therefore, if you compare, you get a is equal to one, b is equal to minus seven, and c is equal to five. The first. The second sum, if you check, it is written this way: that is 2m square is equal to. You can say this is 5m minus 5. This is not in your standard form. First, convert this into standard form. Everything very side me. This is minus 5m plus 5 is equal to 0. We say this is. Okay, what is it? This is of the form that is a x square plus b x plus c is equal to 0. Now, if you compare, you get a is equal to here two, b is equal to you get over here minus five, and c is equal to five. Check the last one. The last one they are written over here this way. Y square is equal to seven y. So this one will be y square minus seven y. If you want to write plus zero is equal to zero, you can say over here is of the form. This is of the form that is a x square plus b x plus c is equal to zero, and therefore you get a is equal to yam be bacha one, b is equal to minus seven, and c is equal to zero. So this is how you have to do the first part. Now check over here. You got these three examples. You have to do this by formula. Normally, yeah, jay ga bacha. This is five. This is six. You can do this. But this is five. Five ones are five. Five plus one is six. But if factorization method is, so you have to do this with formula. So how we do with this with formula? We can write over this as well as standard form. Me. So we say this is of the form that is a x square plus b x plus c is equal to zero. Therefore, you get a is equal to one. Check what you get over here. B that is b is equal to six. And what you get over here c. That is c is equal to five. Very first thing, na, सबसे पहला find out करो b square minus four ac की sum करना है या नहीं करना है. B square will be a six square 
minus 4. What is A? This is 1. What is C? That is 5. This is over 36. Minus what you get over here? 4, 5 is, a, is 20. And what you get over here is 60. Now you can use your formula that is since x is equal to minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac upon 2a. So this is minus, what you get over here? This is 6 plus or minus, already you got this, this is 16 upon this is 2 into 1. How you write this as minus 6, this one will be plus or minus 4 upon 2. Then we can see where this is over here either. We can write this as x is equal to minus 6 plus 4 upon 2 or x is equal to minus 6 minus 4 upon 2. We write that is if x is equal to minus 6 plus 4 upon 2. So x is equal to minus 2 upon 2. We get our x is equal to minus 1. That is all if x is equal to minus 6 minus 4 upon 2. x is equal to minus 10 upon 2. And x is equal to minus 5. So this is called as your formula method. Now if you do with your second sum, if you do with your second sum, this is in your standard form. So again we can say is of the form that is ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. Therefore we get a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus 3, c is equal to minus now the very first thing we find out over here b square minus 4ac. So this is b square minus 4. This is a. This is over here c. Ye bacha 9 minus to minus is plus 4 to is 8. 9 plus 8 is 70. Now go with your formula that is since x is equal to minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac upon 2a. So we get over this is minus of minus 3, here the B, minus 3 here, plus or minus, here yeah, I guess 70, upon 2 into 1. So we get this is 3, plus or minus root of 17 upon 2. And Hogya Bacha, this is your third, you can't add this root of 17 and 3. And therefore we can say x is equal to 3, plus root of 17 upon 2, or we say x is equal to 3. This is as it is, you can't do anything further. So this are your answers. Similarly over here this one, we say this is of the form. Kya aagya bachcha? Ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. Therefore you get a is equal to 3, b is equal to 2 and c is equal to minus 7. Again go with this one that is since b square minus 4 ac so you get out this is 2 square minus 4 into 3 into minus 7 2 square is 4 minus into minus is plus 4 3 is a 12 12 7 is a how much you get that is 84 so this is 88 now go with your formula jai. formula you can have to have m before because you have variable in m hai. over here the variable was x so we wrote x over here the variable was x so we wrote x over here the variable is m to write m and then we have formula same minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac upon 2a this is minus 2 plus or minus 88 upon 2 into 3 check with this one this becomes minus 2 plus or minus third zata hai this is 4 into 22 upon 6 so m is equal to minus 2 plus or minus this will come out this is 22 upon 6 don't do anything cancellation this is 2 is common so minus 1 plus or minus root of 22 upon 6 2 1s are 2 3s are that's all and therefore you can say m is equal to minus 1 plus root of 22 upon 3 or we can say m is equal to minus 1 minus root of 22 upon 3 so this is your sum so you have to do with your formula method Now check with your last three sums so over Again, you have to do with formula. This is in your standard form, so we can see why this is of the form. We got this is ax square 
plus bx plus c is equal to 0. Therefore, we get a is equal to 5, b is equal to a minus 4, and c is equal to minus 2. We find out this is b square minus 4ac. This is b square minus 4. This is a, this is c. This becomes just 16, minus into minus is plus. 4 5 is a 20, 22 is a, we get over here, this is 40. That is 2 5 is a 10, 10 is a 40, and this is over here 56. Now you go with your formula again, that is m is equal to minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac upon kya aega? 2a. So you get m minus b minus 4 plus or minus this is 56 upon this is 2 into 5. I'll write it over here only. This is minus into minus is 4. Ye isko likhne ka 4 into 4 1s are 4 and 4 4s are 16 upon 10. So you write this is m is equal to 4 plus or minus this 4 will come out that is 2 root of 14 upon 10. So you get an m is equal to 2 is common. So 2 plus or minus root of 14 upon 5. So this is 10. And this is 2 1s are 2 5s are. And therefore you get m is equal to 2 plus root of 14 upon 5. Or we say this is m is equal to 2 minus root of 14 upon 5. So this is how you have to do this sum. Here is sum number 2. So this is what you got over here, we will write this as y square plus 1 upon 3y that comes on my side is equal to 0. What do you get here, same over here, this is 3, this goes over here. 3y square plus y and 3 to the 6 is equal to 0. Do your cross multiplication. So you get your equation is 3y square plus y minus 6 is equal to 0. I write it directly, therefore a is equal to 3, b is equal to 1 and c is equal to your minus 6. We find out b square minus 4ac is called discriminant delta b hote hai. b square that is 1 square minus 4a and this is c. This is 1 minus into minus is plus 4 3 is 12, 12 6 is 72. So, here is 73. Go with your formula y is equal to minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac upon 2a. So therefore you will get over this is y is equal to minus b either hai. this is 1 plus or minus 73 upon 2 into a is 3. Ho gaya. Therefore you get y is equal to minus 1 plus or minus 73 upon 6. No cancellation over here. Ho gaya. Therefore y is equal to minus 1 plus root of 73 upon 6 or we say y is equal to minus 1. Minus root of 73 upon 6. This is what you get the answer. Now we will go with the last one of this exercise. Directly I write over here. This is in already in your standard form. A is equal to 5. B is equal to 13. And C is equal to 8. We get this is B square minus 4AC. This is 13 square 4. This is A. This is C. 13 square is 169. This is 4, 5 and 20. 20 into 8 is 160. So what do you get over here? This is 9. Now go with your formula that is x is equal to minus b root of b square minus 4ac upon 2a that is minus b is minus 13 plus or minus this is 9 bacha this one upon 2 into 5. So therefore you get x is equal to minus 13 plus or minus 3 upon 10. Now you have to find that is x is equal to here. If you have to do over here that is either x is equal to minus 13 plus 3 upon 10 or we say x is equal to minus 13 minus 3 upon 10. Pahila wala, if x is equal to minus 13 plus 3 upon 10 so x is equal to minus 10 upon 10 so you get over that is x is equal to minus 1 or if ye wala x is equal to minus 13 minus 3 upon 10. So x is equal to minus 16 upon 10. So this goes with your 2 ka table. That is 2 8s and 2 5s. And you get the answer that is x is equal to minus 8 upon 5. So this is how you have to do with 
फॉर्मूला अभी कैसा रहता है बोर्ड एग्जाम में इफ यू आस्ट विद फॉर्मूला तो फॉर्मूला मेथड ही करने का इफ यू आस्ट विद फैक्ट्राइजेशन तो फैक्ट्राइजेशन मेथड ही करने का ना इफ यू चेक विद दिस वन ये बच्चे यहाँ पे चेक करो दिस इज नाइन इधर आ गया वेरी वेरी गुड दिस इज सेवेंटी इधर आ गया बच्चा दिस इज फिफ्टी सिक्स डू यू नो द स्क्वायर ऑफ फिफ्टी सिक्स नो चेक करो डू यू नो द स्क्वायर ऑफ सेवेंटी थ्री नो डू यू नो द स्क्वायर ऑफ नाइन यस मतलब ये जो दो सम्स है ना इसको आप फैक्टराइजेशन मेथड से कर ही नहीं सकते हो इसको यही मेथड है करने का बिकॉज इफ यू ट्राई टू स्प्लिट द टर्म ना टर्म्स आपका स्प्लिट होगा ही नहीं बट ये फैक्टराइजेशन मेथड से भी होगा एज वेल एज फॉर्मूला मेथड से भी होगा बिकॉज स्क्वायर ऑफ नाइन दैट इज इज थ्री ये और ये नहीं आता है बट बोर्ड एग्जाम में अगर आपको फैक्टराइजेशन मेथड बोला तो योर होगा फैक्टराइजेशन मेथड अगर आपको फॉर्मूला बोला है तो फॉर्मूला तो बोर्ड एग्जाम में चेक करो कि फैक्टराइजेशन करने का या फॉर्मूला करने का अगर कुछ मैंशन नहीं किया तो इट्स योर चॉइस यू कैन डू फैक्टराइज यू कैन डू योर फॉर्मूला मेथड और द प्रीवियस एक्सरसाइज में जो किया दैट इज योर फैक्टराइजेशन मेथड यू कैन डू विद दैट so for today we finish with this video we finish with this exercise also in the next video we'll start with a new exercise till then bye bye tata take care